This is Ref FM Community Radio. Your story, our voice. Welcome to Ref FM Morning News. It is October Friday 20th. My name is Sabine Stella Sisto. Civil war and violence made me flee South Sudan in 2015, together with my seven brothers and sisters. And now I'm taking care of them, plus their four children and my one son, Casimiro. My mother is still in South Sudan and my father has gone. I don't know where he is. Hassan Peter, a teacher from Kalbe Settlement Primary School, said he is glad that the pupils have reported back in a huge numbers for the past two learnings after seven months of his school shutdowns. Life is very hard in a refugee camp. Sometimes we don't have enough to eat. My ultimate dream is to become a professional journalist. A couple of months ago, I got the opportunity to join the community radio station here in the refugee camp, Ref FM KK. As an intern, I read the news. It is really exciting. I was hired by the station manager, Santos. This station is run by and for refugees and host community. We want to inspire our listeners to help them become an active citizens who contribute to society. I was 13 years old when I arrived in this refugee camp with no schooling whatsoever. My ultimate dream now is to become an hunger for BBC Africa. I learn a lot here. Sometimes I co-host a talk show with Lomude from South Sudan in Juba Arabic. Listeners can call in very popular. Popular as well is the Easy Listening Night program from Tony from DR Congo where listeners can request their lovely tracks. And of course, Akuna from Ethiopia with his talent show, refugees sharing their talents with the, list, with the listeners, which is fantastic. But for the time being, I focus on news reading together with Viola, supervised by our news editor, Balu from South Sudan, trained by an international journalist in Nairobi, Ilona. I have a personal coach in Nairobi, Meraji, and I get support from Felix, our technical guy from DR Congo, and of course, from station manager Santos. The management and the station itself also gets a lot of support and advice from Actions Africa Health International, the official owner of the stations, and from Ref FM Foundations, the founder of these stations. They help to make our stations self-sustainable, and they now start radio stations in refugee camps in other countries. We will become one big worldwide refugee radio family. That brings us to the end of our news today in Focus. For more details, visit our website at www.ref-fmkk.com or our Facebook page at Ref FMKK Radio.